Hi, Jason Ganola, TQ Barbecue. When I think of fajitas, the first thing I think about is using that traditional skirt steak that fajitas are known for. The next thing I think about is peppers. I think of that big pile of steaming peppers and onions. To make it pretty, I'm going for a colorful array of red, yellow, and green bell peppers. So I'm in the lab working on some new fajita rubs. I'm going to continue to develop something I'm proud of, and when I do, I'll make it available to everybody. And you know I'm going to be giving some away on the channel. We're going to season with some salt and fajita seasoning. Peppers are looking good. Let's put a couple pats of butter down. This is going to melt into the peppers and onions and create a delicious butter fajita sauce that these onions and peppers are going to sit in while the burger is cooked. Last week's filet mignon video recipe, I showed you an easy way to get it to bumper to bumper medium rare every single time. I also asked you to put down what you think it would pair best with. And VJ, you had everyone's favorite answer. I can't say I don't disagree with everyone. A peppercorn sauce on that filet, along with some garlic mashed potatoes, sounds glorious. Congrats, VJ. DM me your address and I'll get you out some rubbing sauce. Burgers are just about done. Time to add some cheese. Today I'm using pepper jack because when I think of fajita burgers, I think of pepper jack. I was gonna hit these burgers with some lime before I added the cheese, I forgot to, but better late than never. Let's hit it with a little bit of lime citrus to really bring out that beefy flavor. You talk to 10 people, you probably get 10 different answers on how they like the fajita burgers. So set out your condiments and let people build their own burgers. Four condiments I'm putting out today is lime juice and sour cream, guacamole, some fresh pico de gallo, and some hot, hot, hot sauce. Lime sour cream on the bottom. This is exactly what I'm looking for in sauteed peppers and onions. We got the good caramelization. It's gonna give it good texture, bring out all those natural, delicious pepper and onion flavors. Let's come over the top, a little bit of that fresh pico de gallo. Build these fajita burgers how you like them. I'm a hot sauce guy. I'm going heavy on the hot sauce. Incredible aromas as I'm building this burger. I can't take it any longer. Now for my favorite part, the taste test. Hit it with some citrus, wake everything up. That's the best of both worlds. If you can't decide between fajitas and burgers, Try the fajita burger. I've never had sour cream on a burger before, but I really like what it adds to the overall flavor of the fajita burger. If this looked good, if it's something you want to try, give me a thumbs up. For more mouthwatering burger recipes, check out our playlist down below. Jason Goodall, GQ Barbecue, and I'll see you on the next one. Oh, this looks so good. Mmm.